Punk gonna be the last dog on this hog today. Come on, let's see what he's gonna do. Sit. Damn shoes on top. I don't know. I don't know how you gonna do Come on. Good evening. Social media. Punkin is the last dog on the tug today. Hey man, this dude be on this motorcycle. He kind of remind me of the uh I I no 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 I said no you could do that down here. Look you got see now I'm mad because you could have waited till we got to the field man to where I didn't have to clean that shit up my bad y'all but she could have think of the field right there she could have just played it man now i gotta clean that shit up on my way back at least flick it in the grass or something come on hold on girl Dog on the tub tonight. Wait. Man, I have bought this little funny little bridge stick. It don't work that good. Come on, there you go. Go to work, girl. There you go. Now she's bred to breeze right now, but it's so early in her pregnancy, I figure she'll be all right for some work. You know, we, good girl, get them pull ups, girl. We like uh, seven, eight, 10 days into it. 14 up in that. I think, yeah, I think that was about 14, 16 days ago. Good girl. Good dog. That's my dog. Pull ups. Pull ups. Pull ups. Good girl. I love the way pumpkin works this time. Good girl. Hey, the ball's just coming out, man, so you don't got that long. Good dog. I'm gonna go over here and sit on these steps and let you work. Good dog. That's my man. My dog be wanting to do something, bro. You know what I mean? That's why I be having to do this shit. Cause my dogs be wanting to do something. When I don't let them work, they, they acting like they ain't. They act like they ain't good. Act frustrated. Good girl. Get it, girl. I mean, this yard is not far from my yard. Good girl. That's my dog. Punkin. That's my dog. You get it, girl. You go, girl. You go, girl. Good dog. Spicy cooked up some good salmon, potatoes. That shit was fun. Good 
Good girl. That's my dog. That's my dog. So my neighbor, he just bought, they just got them an extra large bully pup. And uh, I guess they all went and got the ears cropped today. Him. Uh, another cat that got one. And the person they got in front. They was out in front of my crib. We chopped it a little bit. I showed him my dog. He was very interested. You know what I mean? He was very interested. He said he's from Jamaica. He said, you know, he's from like the... He said he's like right outside of Kingston, in like the, the country area. He called it Montego or not Montego Bay, but it did start with an M. Oh, oh, don't hurt yourself, girl. Now you got them babies in there. Good girl. Like I said, she's real, real early. Should be good. She, when I was young and dumb, I tell y'all something. When I was young and dumb. In my twenties, I would I would grow a pregnant dog. You know, when she was like in her forties, yeah, when she was like in her forty days, forty fifth day, something like that. I was dumb, man. I used to believe that if you roll them while they're pregnant, uh, it, it puts something in the pup, man. It gives the pup that attitude. Rolled a few pregnant down, down this hill. Not no more than I'm like, dude, that was retarded. Good girl. What were you thinking? And what makes it so crazy, I'm really, I'm not just a dog man. I'm a dog lover. I love dogs. You know what I mean? I just like dogs. I like animals, period. I'm a my animal bump, you know what I mean? I ain't really a nature bump. I don't like being outside and sleeping outside and shit like that. But I like being outside every day during the day. You know, fucking with the dogs and I love cats. Cats are hard, man. I love cats. If your cat was big as your dog, he'll fuck your dog up and eat him. That's what I like about cats. Pretty much anything they kill, they they gonna eat it. They're so close to wild. They're so close to being wild. That's what I like about cats. You know what I mean? Like, a stray cat is like fucking wild, man. You get a hold of it, it's gonna fight your ass. A real stray cat. I remember when I was little, the store that George Floyd got killed at, uh, I don't know if y'all, I don't even know, but I'm sure y'all heard about the George Floyd, you know, shit. Well, that's where I'm from. That's where I, you know, where I grew up. I used to live not far from where he got killed, like maybe six, seven blocks, five blocks. Let me see, that's on 38th in Chicago. I lived on 39th and 11th. So that's one block over, three blocks up, yeah, four blocks. I brought it up to say there used to be a, uh, a house behind there. People lived in the house, but they didn't use their garage. So every summer, or whenever the weather was warm, there was a, a, a litter of kittens in there. I mean, all pretty much all summer long. I don't know how often cats come in heat, or maybe it was two or three females that lived in there, but it was always a litter of kittens. And like I said, I love cats. I used to try to catch them all. Never, not once was I successful. Them little motherfuckers was wild already. It was probably you know, just off of the nipple. And it was already wild. I gotta hurry up. It's time to feed the dog. I ain't fed the dog today. Clean the yard twice. Ain't put food in nobody's butt. I'm gonna do that now.